If you've ever tried creating animated stories with AI, you know how difficult it is to keep your characters consistent in every scene. But do you know now you can generate your characters just once and easily create videos where they appear in different scenes while staying completely consistent? Even better, you can add multiple characters and have them interact seamlessly in your videos, and this is something most AI tools still can't do. In this video, I will show you how to use some valuable tools that comes with Kling AI's latest update to create character consistent animation videos quickly and easily. Let's go to the Kling AI website. You can log in with a Google account. Here on the main page, we see three options, AI images, AI videos, and effects. Before jumping into videos, though that's the most exciting part, Let's first see how we can generate images with consistent characters. Let's go to the AI Images tab. Here, I'm entering a prompt to create a Pixar-style male character. We also have the option to upload a reference image, but for now, we'll leave that blank. Next, I'm selecting the aspect ratio and choosing the number of images to generate. All right, here it is. Our character is ready. Now we're stepping into a very important part. I want to generate another image with the same character. To do this as you would expect, we simply upload the image we created earlier as a reference. Boom! Now it offer us three options. What are they? With the first option, we can tell that we want the character to appear exactly the same way in the second image. With the second option, we can reference to just the face of, of our character, meaning we can create any character, but with the same face. And this is what I get when I asked for a boy with a robotic body. As you can see, the face hasn't changed. Now, I'll show you how to create videos with multiple characters while keeping amazing consistency. This will make animation storytelling easier than ever. All right, let's click on the AI videos tab and select the image to video option. Here, you'll see three options, frames, elements, and effects. Right now, we are focusing on the elements tab. Here, we can upload up to four reference images. We'll come back to this in a bit. This is where we enter our prompt. We also have the option to choose between standard and professional mode. Professional mode gives higher quality videos, but uses more credits. Next, we can set the video duration, select the aspect ratio, and if needed, enter a negative prompt to exclude any unwanted elements from the video. Let's create a video. Here, I am uploading an image of a girl, an image of a boy, an image of some creature, and a jungle background. And I am gonna say, little boy and a girl pointing fingers towards cute creature on a tree branch and interacting with it. Here's the video. As you can see, the girl, boy, and the red creature are all seamlessly blended into the background we uploaded. Now, if we want to place the same characters into a different scene, all we have to do is change the prompt and one or more of uploaded images. Here's the video. Once again, our two characters are placed in a completely new environment, and they blend in perfectly. Just like this, you can create all your story scenes simply by adjusting the elements and the prompt to match your vision. It's that easy. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think there is an easier way to create consistent character videos? If you found this video helpful, please like it and subscribe for more future content like this.